this guy had a fracture of the D11 vertebra uh, due to a fall that's about a year back and uh, the examination of the spine and the fluoroscopy there's the IP view which is showing there is a compression fracture of the D11 vertebra it's a bevel needle from Cook which uh, we just put percutaneously under fluoroscopy guidance uh, into one of the pedicle uh, that's on the left side and we try to take the pedicle into the center and uh, as anteriorly as possible. That, uh, this, uh, uh, during this procedure we have to examine the spine from AP and lateral view cost and so we just have to try to put the needle uh, into the middle of the uh, vertebra and on the anterior border that is what we have done which is saying uh, that the needle is placed absolutely in the anterior border of the cement which is uh, filling the entire vertebra very nicely and the cement is coming all the way to the proximal uh, two-third, proximal one-fourth of the vertebra, which is our aim to fill the vertebra entirely and, and to come all the way uh, down till, till the posterior portion of the vertebra. And uh, this is what we have achieved here. And if you have a, uh, a good view, a close view, we can see it very nicely. The cement has occupied the entire vertebra. And if you look at the AP view, it looks absolutely fantastic uh, with a good spread of the uh, cement in a very even fashion for the entire vertebra and the patient is having a very good pain relief in 10 minutes post procedure so we expect about 90% pain relief by tomorrow and uh, that's how we will